I'm friends at the Mastic Marucci Shirley Library. It's Miss Kathy and my friend George the Monkey. Thank you for bringing us into your home today. Are you ready to sing and play and listen to a fun story? Yes? Okay. I hope everybody's healthy and happy and enjoying our beautiful spring. Can you raise your hand in the air if you are loving the spring? Yay! George is raising his hand too. I hope that you're able to go out and play in the front of your house or at the playground or maybe go to the beach. And I hope that you're going for walks and I hope that you are noticing all the colors. They're starting. We can have leaves on the trees and the grass is going to be greener. <laughs> and the flowers. Oh, I love the flowers. All the colors. And I think this is a very, very special spring. Yay, spring is here. Clap hands for spring. And today, can we sing the Hello Everybody, Yes Indeed song? Because it's a nice way to say hi to people or hello to people with a song, right? Yes, of course. One, two, three, everybody please. Hello everybody, yes indeed, yes indeed. Yes, indeed. Hello, everybody. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed, my darling. Yay. Are you ready to jump with George the monkey? Oh, oh ah, ah. he wants to jump with you. Can you stand up and jump and sing three little monkeys jumping on the bed? Are you ready, grown-ups? Let's all sing together. One, two, three. Three little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. The mama called the doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. Two little monkeys jumping on the bed. Jump high. He fell off and bumped his head. The mama called the doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. One more time. One little monkey jumping on the bed. She fell off and bumped her head. The mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. Yay! I hope boys and girls, you are jumping all over the place, except not on the bed. We don't ever want you to get hurt. I have an idea. I'm not sure if we've sung this song before. It's really silly. Raise your hand if you're silly. <laughs> yes, me too. Tony Chestnut is the name of it. Tony Chestnut. Have we sung that one before? I think I've sung it with the little babies, but you guys are getting so big. But I think it's a good song. But instead of singing about Tony Chestnut, we're going to sing Toe, Knee. Where is your knee? Do you know where your knee is? Touch your knee. And this is your chest. Right near your chest. And guess what? This is your nut in this song. Your head. Can you touch your head? Nut. Toe, knee, chest, nut. Nose. I love you. And you can give yourself a hug. Or your grown-up that's taking good care of you a hug. Isn't that a silly song? Can we sing it together? Okay, ready? Try to sing along with me. Say the words, whatever words you can here and that you can remember and it's always good to do it two times we need to practice it and then it stays in our head more a little bit not always <laughs> tony chestnut here we go one two three tony chestnut knows i love you tony knows Tony knows from the beginning. Tony chest nut <laughs> knows I love you. That's what Tony knows. Were you singing that? It's a silly song. Okay, can we do it together? Ready? One more time. One, two, three, together. Tony chest nut. Knows I love you, Tony knows, knows, Tony knows, knows, T 
Tony, chest, nut, nose, I love you. That's what Tony knows. Yay! That's a good one. Can I ask you, boys and girls and grown-ups, can you practice that one? Can we do it all day? And another one that's a little similar is head, shoulders, knees, and toes. We know that one. Can we do that? Ready? Okay, here we go. One, two, three. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees and toes, and eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees and toes. Were you doing it? <laughs> Such a fun song. More, more, more. George the monkey is saying, more, 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 please. Okay, but I have an idea. Can we do it fast and silly? Yes? Okay, ready? One, two, three, go! Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. And eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. <laughs> I think we have to do it one more time. Because I know you're silly, I'm silly. Let's do it really fast and silly. One, two, three. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, and eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Do, 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 do. Did you do it? <laughs> Thank you so much, boys and girls. You have so much fun. I'm going to put George. Where am I going to put George? I'm going to put George over here. Oh, you know what? I'm going to take Barney. Remember Barney the dinosaur? Remember this, grown-ups? Some of your mommies and daddies grew up with Barney. And... A nice song from Barney is Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun. And we sing that because we need a lot of sun in the spring. Can you sing that? Okay, I hope so. Ready? Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, here we go. One, let's count to three, please. One, two, three. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun. Mr. Golden Sun, hiding behind the trees. These little children are asking you to please come out so they can play with you. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. Yay! And a song that we have sung before, boys and girls, Seven Days of the Week. I know that song. I think it's also a Barney song. Put Barney music on. Ask A-L-E-X-A. -E I don't want to say her name because I don't want her to put the Barney music on. But it's kind of fun, Barney. Okay, what was that? Oh, was I thinking? What was I saying? <laughs> Just looking. Oh, the seven days of the week. Are you ready? We have done this before, but it's something we need to practice. And we might need our grown-ups' help with this one. Are you ready? One, two, three. There are seven days, there are seven days, there are seven days in the week. There are seven days, there are seven days, there are seven days in the week. Let's sing it. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Yay! I hope that you're singing that all the time. Yes? Okay. I'm going to put my friend Barney. Barney, you stay over here. And I'm going to get out my egg shapers. Do you have any instruments nearby? Look around. If you have them, grab them. If not, that's okay. Because really, your voice is my favorite instrument. I love when we sing together. It looks blue when I go like this. I think it looks blue to you. But boys and girls, over here is purple. And this is a green. And you know I love when we sing the ABCs together, my favorite song. Are you ready? Let's do it nice and loud and proud. One, two, three. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, everybody. H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X. Y and Z. Now I know my ABCs. 
next time will you sing with me? Oh, I dropped my egg shaker. Did you see that? Should I pick it up? Yes. And boys and girls, if you drop something, what do you have to do? Yes, you have to pick it up. We don't want things all over the floor willy-nilly. And then if we don't pick it up, we might not know where we left it and we're going to look for it. So if you drop something, you pick it up and you also put things away. <laughs> I am always saying this to my grandchildren. And they're doing it because we're singing it, honestly. Singing it makes everything better. Okay, I think it's to the tune of, if you're happy and you know it, it's my new song, not my new uh, tune I'm putting everything to. One, two, three, let's sing. If you drop something, pick it up, pick it up. If you drop something, pick it up, pick it up. If you drop something, if you drop something, if you drop something, pick it up, pick it up. I think this is an important song to learn. Grown-ups, let's sing it with them. Ready? One, two, three. If you drop something, pick it up, pick it up. If you drop something, pick it up, pick it up. If you drop something, if you drop something, if you drop something, pick it up, pick it up. It's a good thing to do, boys and girls. And another thing that's very nice to do, sharing. Do you like to share? It's a little hard to do, and you don't always have to share your very, very special things. Sometimes if we share things, it makes it more fun. So here's another little song about sharing that I hope you will all sing with me. And it's to the tune of the Winnie the Pooh song. It goes like this. We'll do it two times so you can practice it and learn it. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Sharing is fun. Let's sing it. Sharing is fun. Sharing is fun for everyone. Sharing is fun. Sharing is fun. Sharing is fun for everyone. But it's something we have to practice. You know what, boys and girls? Even grown-ups, we have to practice it. And it feels good. It's a little hard to do it, but then when you do it, you feel really good about yourself sharing. Can we do it again? Sharing and singing, those are the best things. One, two, three. Sharing is fun, sharing is fun. Sharing is fun for everyone. Sharing is fun, sharing is fun. Sharing is fun for everyone. Yay! Now that I have my egg shakers, can we do some counting? Counting is fun too, yes? Say yes, yes. <laughs> Let's count to 20. Are you ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. We did it. We did it. Are you counting all day, boys and girls? Yes, I hope so. I think we've talked about, this is a fun game to do. Um, I think we've talked about it before. Walking around your house and counting things. You could do it with your grown up, or you could do it by yourself, or you could do it with your brother or sister, or your doggy, or your cat. Why not? So you can walk around. Let's think of some things that you can count. Chairs, you can count windows. Beds, and I've mentioned this before, smoke alarms. We have to make sure we have those smoke alarms. And my granddaughters and I, they love to count, um, yes, count smoke alarms. Uh, you can count anything you want. And also, when we go outside for walks, we can count trees, or we can count birdies, or flowers. There's going to be a lot of flowers. That's a lot of counting. Speaking of birds, can we tell you? Can I tell you? That's my story. <laughs> can you put your hands behind your back 
and I'm going to tell you a story about two little blackbirds. So can you put your hand behind your back, and then we're going to take out our pointer finger. This is our strongest finger, our pointer finger. Ready? One, two, three. Two little blackbirds sitting on a hill. One named Jack. Oh, hello. Oh, one named Jill. Hello. Fly away, Jack. Fly away. Fly away, Jill. Come back, Jack. Come back, Jill. Yay! And the kissing. Can we do it again? This is a fun one when we're out for our walks. Sing, uh, tell me a story. One, two, three. Two little black birds sitting on a hill. One named Jack. Hello. One named Jill. Fly away, Jack. Fly away, Jill. Come back, Jack. Come back, Jill. Yay! Come on, kisses, kisses. Did you like that little story? I have another story that I would like to tell you about planting a garden, planting some flowers. Raise your hand if you've been out planting gardens, getting the dirt ready and planting seeds, and then we have to water it, right? So we're going to pretend we have the best imagination. I know you do. So we're going to break up the dirt, get the dirt ready, and then we'll put seeds in there. How many seeds do you think we should put in? Ten? Ten is a very good amount. And then what is going to make our garden grow? What do we need? Sunny skies. Yes, we need the rain. Could you go like this? Raindrops, raindrops. And then we need the sun, the big, beautiful sun. And then our gardens will grow big and tall. Can you jump up in the air? Big and tall. And you are our beautiful gardens. Okay, ready? Get your get down on the ground. Get your dirt ready. <clears throat> Here's the story. One, two, three. Here is my garden. Here is my garden, I'll plant it with care. I will plant my seeds in there. Let's put 10 in, ready? Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The sun will shine and the rain will fall. Get ready, boys and girls, we're going up in the air. And my beautiful garden will grow big and tall. You are the best. You are the best little gardens. Can we do it again? Let's do it again. One, two, three. Here is my garden. I'll plant it with care. I will plant my seeds in there. Let's do 15 seeds. Okay, let's count to 15. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, good job. The sun will shine and the rain will fall and my beautiful garden, get ready to jump up, will grow big and tall. We did it, we did it. I am so proud of you. I'm always proud of you. Now, we're gonna sing a song called Open, Shut Them. And what happens after we sing that song? What does Miss Kathy do? I'm going to read you a book. Are you ready? Let's do the open, shut them, and we'll get comfortable and ready for story time. One, two, three. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Okay, can you sit down? about three minutes. I haven't timed it, but it's only a few minutes, boys and girls. Sit down. I'm going to come closer. Ooh, I have to move something here so you can see the illustrations, which means pictures, boys and girls. Okay, this is one of my favorite books, and I got it from the library. The Napping House. And if you've noticed, grown-ups, I read a lot of books by Audrey Wood. The glare will go away when I open it up the book. It's got some plastic over it and the sun is shining from my window in and that's why we have a little bit of a glare. 
but it won't um, appear when I open up the book. Are you ready? A napping house. Here we go. There is a house, a napping house, where everyone is sleeping. Can you say that with me? Where everyone is sleeping. Will you help me read this book? And you can say that each time I say it. And in that house, there is a bed, a cozy bed, in a napping house. Now we all say it together. Where everyone is sleeping. Very good. I'm so proud. And on that bed, there is a granny. A snoring granny. On a cozy bed. In a napping house. Everybody ready? Where everyone is sleeping. Look at the granny. And on that granny, there is a child. A dreaming child on a snoring granny. On a cozy bed. In a napping house where everyone is sleeping. Very good. Thank you for saying that with me. These are funny pictures. And on that child, oh, there is a dog, a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a snoring granny, oh, on a cozy bed, in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. Good job. And on that dog, there is a cat, a snoozing cat, on a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a snoring granny. Can you snore? On a cozy bed, in a napping house, where everyone is sleeping. Boys and girls, Look at this bed. <laughs> Everybody's on the bed all over the place. And on the cat, there is a mouse, a slumbering mouse, on a snoozing cat, on a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed, in a napping house, where everyone is sleeping. Good job. Thank you. And on that mouse, there is, oh, did I skip a page? I did say the mouse, sorry, sorry, sorry. And on that mouse, there is a flea. Can it be a wakeful flea? On a slumbering mouse, on a snoozing cat, on a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed, in a napping house, where Everyone is sleeping. Funny book. A wakeful flea who bites the mouse. Oh no, look at the mouse up in the air. Who scares the cat? Who claws the dog? Who thumps the child? Oh my goodness, look at the child up in the air. Who bumps the granny? Who breaks the bed? Oh my goodness, look! In the napping house where no one now is sleeping. <laughs> the end. If you like that story, can you clap hands? Did you like that story? I hope you did, I hope you did. I have, oh, you know what I have? Let me see. I have my little fishy instruments. You know my little fishy instruments? I love this song. Have you ever been to the aquarium? where all the fish are. They live, they live in the ocean, but then some special fish live in the aquarium. Maybe you can go visit the aquarium soon. 
and see all different color fish. Now, I have my fish instruments here. Aren't they cute? But if you want to put your hands together like this and pretend that you are the fish swimming in the water. Can you do that, everyone? Yay, let's sing it. The fish in the water. One, two, three. The fish in the water goes this way and that away, this way and that away, this way and that away. The fish in the water goes this way and that away. Bubble, bubble, splash. Did you get wet from the fish? They splashed you. One more time, please. The fish in the water goes this way and that away. This way and that away, this way and that away. The fish in the water goes this way and that away. Bubble, bubble, splash. We did it, we did it, we really, really did it. And now we'll say bye bye fishy, bye bye fishy. Hello bubbles. And B is the first letter of bubbles. So we're gonna sing. B is for bubbles. One, two, three. B is for bubbles, that's good enough for me. B is for bubbles, that's good enough for me. B is for bubbles, that's good enough for me. Oh, bubbles, 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 start with B. One more time, please. B is for bubbles, that's good enough for me. B is for bubbles, that's good enough for me. B is for bubbles, that's good enough for me. Oh, bubbles, 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 start with B. You gone outside and blown some bubbles? Don't eat the bubbles, just put it close to, and up to your mouth, but don't put it in your mouth. And blow bubbles. And how do we end every one of our classes together? We do the TikTok song. Are you ready? Here we go, rocking side to side. Let's sing it. Tick tock, tick tock, I'm a little cuckoo clock. Tick Tick tock, tick tock. Now I'm striking one o'clock. Away fly. Go, go! Where'd George go? Oh, there he is. Thank you, everybody. I hope you had fun. Raise your hand. Did you have fun? I hope so. And are you going to sing the rest of the day? Yes, me too. And I will see you next Friday. I miss you, little boys and girls. I miss you all. Go visit the Mastic Maritza Shirley Library. We have the best librarians, and they would love for you to come in and visit and borrow books. I'll see you next Friday. Happy spring! Bye, everyone. Can you say bye, George? Bye, everybody. Oh.